so we just got here to Houston right now. It was a three and a half hour flight. I'm exhausted, I'm tired, but we are getting a rental car right now, me and my dad. And then we're gonna go to the hotel. It's gonna be amazing, I'm so excited for this trip. I have a lot of luggage with me. I'm so hungry right now, we're gonna go get food. I have not ate all day and I'm super hungry. I don't know what to get, I don't even know what to run here, but we'll find something out. I'm so happy guys, I want you guys to know like this is a big opportunity for me and I'm so happy that I'm gonna be hanging out with all the athlete members this weekend and you know, they just, they just have changed my life and you know, I don't know, I'm just, I'm holding this camera right now because of guys like that, you know? So I really hope at the end of this, I can always bring you guys good motivation. I can always pick you guys up, make your guys' day. And um, I hope all you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see you right now. So I got to my hotel, I had Taco Bell. I'm so exhausted, I'm gonna go get some sleep. And I hope you guys enjoy the clips from my outfit trip. It's an amazing experience. I'm so excited. And I will see you guys tomorrow at the gym. Good morning, guys. So right now it's about 10 o'clock. And I got my outfit backpack. I got my suitcase. We're about to head to the gym right now. I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. So right now I got a white outfit scoop neck, biker jeans, my Adidas Pure Boost. I got this 5'11 hat watch i'm so excited to go to the hq and i'll see you guys there i'm right here in alphalete right now and i'm just waiting for brandon to go ahead and see if they have any more trucker hats for me i wanted to go see if they have any more check out this mirror though guys check out this mirror this is where javon does all his cool stuff right here I'm so pumped up to be here guys and I'm just so so excited and I just I don't know. I just so happy and I will check with you guys in a little bit. Here comes Brandon right with my caps. Oh, you honestly I haven't met that many Tims in my life. Tim, nobody cares how many Tims you have. I've met one Tim and it was the greatest Tim of all time. It's not you by the way. Damn. It's Timmy Turner. Wow. Oh, girl, you can talk to me. Dude, does it bother you like when people call you Timmy or something? Yeah. Sometimes. It's, it's kind of like a beta, kind yeah. of, right? Yeah. What's up, bro? Okay, so here's a personal letter that I wrote for you, man. Bottom of my heart, I really wrote that to you, you know what I mean? Okay. Appreciate yeah. that, bro. Yeah, I did. You didn't have to. I'll read it, I'll read it later. Yeah, yeah. And then... Thanks, bro. So, obviously, I got you some Oh, dude. No. Bro, you didn't have to, man. No, nah, appreciate bro. it. You changed my life, bro, so I want to... Uh, ooh, fresh navy too, bro. That, bro. I don't know if you have that color or not. No, but... I don't, bro. I'm Perfect actually... to go with our lifestyle items. Bye now. Uh, <laughs> I'm about to record this, bro. <laughs> I'll believe this. I'll be so okay, so we're here with my boy, Tim. I actually met you back in LA, right? Yeah. Went to LA at Fit Expo the Definitely. first time, and then the YouTubers retreat, right? Yeah. So my name is Tim Yanez. I'm 20 years old. I'll be 21. In two weeks, I came out to Alphalete because these guys have honestly changed my life, and I just want to go ahead and get back to all of them. And I bought Tim Rodriguez a pair of shoes. I appreciate it, man. Chucks, like everyone who watches me, just know. I mean, I like. I prefer. Honestly, I've had like I wear Chucks today. Tim has small feet. And then he also got me, wrote me a personal letter. So I, dude, I honestly like. Appreciate it, man. Thank you for inspiring me, changing my life, bro. Yeah, thanks for coming down. So we're about to hit a workout, actually. So I just asked him, we're gonna hit some chest right now. Hit some chest and maybe some triceps, because last night I hit some back and shoulders. But, you down? Down. Bro. Again, bro, appreciate it, man. Anytime, Thanks for support. Man. So like, right over here, like, this is all, like our, our turf, this is where our strength and conditioning training. So you see, you got the tire, you can pull sleds on here and stuff. Um, all the way back here, we got these two big power racks. That's where Russ, Russ Wool takes all the weights and just uh, squats. But, uh, we have all our cardio equipment back there. All our leg machines right here. Back machines, chest machines, and then two dumbbell sections, and a shit ton of pulleys over here. This is it, bro.
Tim just finished our chest workout. It was not too long. We're in there, what, maybe about an hour? About an hour. Got a good, decent amount of volume. Tore my chest, so I'll definitely be sore, but how'd you like it, man? First day here, or second day, technically second day here. But Real good, tired, so I haven't ate anything, so I gotta go get some food in me right now. But thank you, man, for letting me get in the workout with you, man. Appreciate it. Yeah. I mean, meeting guys like Tim, it's like truly inspiring to not only myself, I mean, as you see in this whole video or the next video after this, that you know, he went out of his way, he stepped outside his comfort zone to come all the way from Cali here to Texas just to so, show support to not only myself, Christian, everybody, the whole Alphalete team. Rodas took the time out of his day to write us a nice, sincere letter, got us a nice gift, and we, I really appreciate that. I know we all really appreciate that. And it's like, there's always, this just goes to show you like, no matter what, you may be going through a hard time, but there's still, you can't let it show, even though sometimes, in life, I know I'm kind of going off on tangent right now. Sometimes in life, you know, it may throw you curveballs. You feel like giving up, but it's guys that you come across like Tim that continue to push you and chasing your dream, continue to do what you do. And it's just truly inspiring. And I'm sure a lot of people would like just, it's almost like pursuing your dreams. Like you wanted to come down to Alphalete, so he flew down here. And it's a matter of just stepping outside your comfort zone and just going for it. You know, simply something as little as coming here to Texas, going like, from Cali to here to hang out with us and that's stepping outside your comfort zone and a lot of people I feel like have troubles doing that. Um, were you nervous like planning this trip at all or are you just anxious ready to get here? Because we've met a couple times already. You know what actually you know I was a little bit nervous, a little bit nervous because I'm not familiar with them. I'm driving around, don't really know the area and stuff like that but at the end of the day you know I think it's worth it because these guys have honestly changed my life. Tim's changed my life, Charlie, Christian, Javon, Becca's changed my life, Derek, everyone's changed my life and you know, I feel like it's worth it to give back to those people in life. People who do you right and who are so inspiring and just there for you all the time. I feel like, you know, it's cool to say a little thank you every once in a while. You know, so hopefully you enjoyed your gift, man. Dude, honestly, like, there are no words. Like, I'm so thankful, like, for him doing this, coming out of the way to do this for us. And it's just truly motivating. And it's, I feel like th stuff like this happens for a reason. Like, I continue to push myself, you know, and videos and workouts and just day-to-day -day basis outside the gym. Uh, it's really cool to have stuff like this happen and it's definitely like a reminder to know that you're spreading positivity and know that you're at least impacting one life as it's a lot so thank you man thanks brother you squat squat dude yeah squat squat leg press walking lunges and then calves except for the dream right so since Derek since Derek is stressed Ashley you, you heard it first, actually. Because I have no stresses in my life whatsoever. It's like taking your brain. None. But it's all about satisfying. <laughs> Me and Derek, should we I cook for him? Clean for him? Pick him up after him? Wash dishes? Tuck him in a bed? Maybe read him a story? Give him a glass of wine? Wake up? Cook him breakfast? 
Wait, wait, wait. and this is why. Damn. So, um, I typically, when I'm not working, I, I'm at my apartment, or most of all, like right now, I'm on my shift right now, and I just use this time to obviously continue to greet members when they come in, uh, continue to walk the weight room, make sure everything's clean and organized, not the gym's not trash, but I also go through all, I'll do my online coaching, respond to my clients. And then go through my business email and just inquires and just stay busy like that. And then towards the end of the shift, just kind of die down and get ready to leave. But on the other side, I'm like, he's loving life right now. That that reminds me of Bro, hold up. No, I just don't get That's why I need the Snapchat spectacles. Really so like, this is the most organized it'll be. Oh, there we have all our joggers. I actually have more joggers coming in Monday. Got smalls down here, women's, mediums. <laughs> See how high this sex. Larges, XL and double XLs right here. But this is like, is it organized? Don't record him like he's in here all the time working. I did it. <laughs> this B. I was about to give credit to fucking Derek, but you know what? <laughs> yeah, fucking you hear her? The one bragging. Derek is the one that puts in Derek and Carson, but Ashley's been here since day one. Her <laughs> fiance, Derek. I'm put, just kidding. On, no, him. no. On some real shit, Derek busts his ass here every single day. Okay. I personally know because I used to work with Derek every day here before my role changed, but people don't realize, like, they think, okay, the launch, like, it's just so easy. I mean, you can yeah, ask Derek. Know. It's just gonna be, okay, we can order stuff, but. Ask Derek, <laughs> he stays busy in like two weeks. It's always, you're always preparing for the next launch, how to improve things, but Derek, this is actual like labor work he does in here. You see these boxes, how everything's organized, inventory counted, boxes cut open. This is Derek, so this.